to the judge, we vote. <laughs> Decide whether or not the wolf is guilty or not guilty. He looks guilty to me. Me too. What do you mean he looks guilty? Did you see those teeth? Those wolves have sharp teeth. The better to gobble you up, right? Am I right? But the trial isn't about the wolf biting someone. It's about her blowing down those two houses. Actually, the three houses. Actually, only two of the houses got knocked down. He huffed and puffed and blew the houses down with those innocent applicants. Poor oh, swine. I tell you, wolves are dangerous. All right, let's get down to this. Now, since I'm the fool, don't you mean a poor pig? What's a fall, man? Can I bring things to somebody? It means when I get back in the I'll be the one doing all the talk. Can you just get on with this? For the trial, now we need to decide whether the big bad wolf is guilty or not guilty. I don't think we should call a big bad wolf. Oh, just, just so let's vote. All those who believe the wolf is guilty say oink. 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 Not, no not oinking. What's that? I'm not oinking. I'm voting not. Oh. Mama me. <laughs> you think that the big bad wolf is innocent? Well, I haven't made my mind up yet. There's been so many stories about wolves doing terrible things. Maybe we've paid more attention to those fairy tales and not enough attention to the evidence. And there should be enough evidence to convince us all of the wolf skills beyond reasonable doubt. There's plenty of evidence. Well, I'd like to hear what you think. That sounds fine. Let's go around and tell our fellow kids why we think that the big bad wolf is Why don't you go first? Me? Oh, well, I can just imagine him packing and packing his men and darkness to the whole little house. But you didn't see her do it. But you didn't see her not do it. You didn't see her not not do it. Huh? Look, the facts of the case are this. These three little pigs, just like you and me, they move away from home. They were brothers, so they decided to build their houses nearby. One pig built his house out of straw. The other built his house out of sticks. And the other brother built his house out of bricks. And then what happens? This wolf comes along, pretending to be selling cookies or something, and when the pig won't open up the door, whoosh, down goes the house of straw. The little pig runs to his brother's house made of sticks, the wolf follows, and whoosh, down goes house number two. Clear case of destruction of property. And it's a good thing their brother pig made a house out of bricks because it was strong enough to protect them from being eaten up by that evil wolf. Thank you for sharing. But more than anything, I just didn't trust that wolf. She claimed she was a wolf scout, so a wolf scout from door to door. But there's no such thing as a wolf scout. Oh, but there is. There's cub scouts and wolf scouts and trout scouts and all sorts of scouts. They're very nice people. These are cookies she was selling. Because wolves don't eat cookies. No. They eat pork chops. Yeah. And, and ham hocks. Yeah. Stop agreeing with everything we say. Yeah. All this is talk about food is making me Me too. We should have some lunch or something. Now, no. as I was saying, I just don't think the wolf huffed and puffed at all. Did you see him wearing that sheepskin? That was so unstylish. I just saw right through that. He needs to get some different clothes. Well, if he didn't go down those houses, then he did. Think about it. Of the three little pigs, only one knew how to build houses well, and he built his out of brick. The house of those straw and sticks were so frail they could have just fallen down when the wolf politely knocked on the door. Politely knocked? Do you believe this one? I'm just saying it's possible. And since when do wolves blow air with the force of the hurricane? Very good point. I once saw a documentary on wolves and it didn't mention anything about puffing or puffing. It reminds me of something else the wolf, the defendant forgot to mention. The wolf had an inhaler in its wolf pack. So what? So, how can a wolf puff and puff if she has asthma? <gasps> Very well. All those who believe that the wolf is guilty say oink. I'll go first. Not oinking. Not oinking. Not oinking. No, not oinking. Defend poor pig, I think we're ready.
<laughs> have you reached a verdict yet? Yes, Your Honor, I we have. And what is it? We, the jury, find the defendant not guilty. Very well, then. The defendant is released. Oh, thank goodness! I didn't think anyone would believe me. We were just doing our job. It's not always easy when everybody thinks they're a big bad wolf. Police! Arrest the big bad wolf! No! Oh, 